Here is my social media. Check out my Roblox group and merch. Hey everyone, Ashley Bunny here, and today we're gonna be doing yet another review. And we literally have possibly the cutest keyboard on planet Earth. I mean, I know mine is cute. Like, <laughs> I know this one is cute, but this one is so cute. And you guys will see why in a second. Let's go ahead and get right into the unboxing. So, I have a confession to make. I literally got this package mm, a month and a half ago, two months ago. I'm so sorry <gasps> to Aiko or Akko. I'll link all their like social media and stuff down in the description down below in case you guys want to go, you know, buy their stuff, go check out their products. But yeah, anyways, guys, this is an old <laughs> PR package. So yeah, it's like creeping up on two months that I have been, you know, holding off on opening this like I literally haven't even opened it yet I opened the top when I got it like from the mail and then that was it <laughs> I just like put it away because I wasn't making videos at the time and I was like oh I'm really unmotivated but now we're you know getting back into it you know get into it yeah get into it so I'm going to be using my oh my it's so embarrassing my dirty this is like literally disgusting my dirty cat knife <laughs> yeah so my knife is kind of grimy and dirty because i use it to open everything like literally anything you can imagine i've used this to open it i should probably get a new one um i could i didn't really need this knife i honestly could have just slid this out the top but it's so difficult to get out and i broke the plastic as you can see like six times trying to like rip this out of here but I think I kind of got it so and sorry for the shaking I'm on very unstable ground here like with this whole like tripod setup it's not really a tripod it's my boom arm <laughs> if you can believe it's just it's a really horrible setup and I need to get an actual tripod so sorry for the shaking okay I think I jinxed myself I was like I think I got it but it's really not happening right now <laughs> Oh gosh, okay. I might have to speed this up. Yeah. No more box. And here is the keyboard. A Hello Kitty keyboard. And let's get rid of this like wrapping or whatever this is. Goodbye plastic wrap. And Hello Keyboard. Oh my gosh. <gasps> get it? Hello Keyboard, Hello Kitty. So they are orange switches, which is what I requested. Like they just took care of my every need. I was like, what? Like they're like, yeah, we have pink keyboards, but hey, we also have Hello Kitty keyboards. And I literally had like a whole heart attack. And they were like, you guys can get whatever switches you want. And by you guys, I mean, of course, customers, anybody buying them, receiving them in any way. But yeah, here's the box. So cute. So Hello Kitty says, oh, look at the fun I'm having today. So she got some snacks, she got a mouse. This looks like a toy or her friend. I'll never know. And then the back just has her on a box and then it shows a preview of the keyboard. All right, I literally, um, I don't know how to get this out of here. I think it's another like sleeve. Another sleeve, by the way, guys. Oh yeah, it is another sleeve. Okay, I'll just push it out this end. Oh man, this is cool. Okay, the lid is off. This is so cool, what the heck? This is so cool, like honestly, look at this like cool reflective thing. Enough shenanigans, enough dilly-dallying. Anything on the back? Nope, so I'm guessing I'm supposed to open it this way. Here's the reveal. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is so cute, you guys. Wait, let me get this on camera. You guys can't miss this. Oh my gosh, let's get the covering off. Well, there's more than one covering. Oh my gosh, guys. Insane. <laughs> Not me throwing things across the room. If you hear crashes, like distant crashing, that's me throwing packaging around. So just don't mind that. And let's get rid of this like little sleeve. Oh my gosh. Can I like rip this? Yeah, thanks. I like the like secure wrapping. Like my Razer keyboard didn't even come with this. Like you guys can see, like go watch my unboxing video for Razer. Didn't even have this. Oh. Oh, I, that scared me. There's, okay, <laughs> that might have been my fault. Like, I'm not gonna lie. There is a key, like, off 
and I promise that's probably my fault. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Let's get it out of the box. Let's hoist it out of the box, you know what I'm saying? This comes with a user manual, and girl, I don't even know what this is. So let's just get the keyboard back in frame, and we're gonna have a typing test in a moment, momentarily. But guys, can we just, hold on, we're gonna get a close up. Like, no way am I gonna like, not give you guys a close up. By the way, don't look at the things on my desk. Like, ew, literally spilled coffee yesterday. Who cares, okay. <laughs> okay, who cares? Look at this keyboard. This is awesome, you guys. But let's just take a look at all the different keys. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. The volume buttons. Hello Kitty around like the little arrows, the shift key, oh. And then, oh my gosh, the keyboard, I mean the space bar is my favorite part of the keyboard. Oh my gosh, amazing. Oh, I think that's enough fangirling. And of course the escape button is the cutest thing ever. Also before I like start like the clickety clackety and stuff, um, the back of this keyboard actually has like little stands. Like let me show you guys. Similar to my Razer keyboard, it has like different levels of stands. You know, like in case you want your keyboard elevated a bit. I usually like mine super elevated, so I'm usually like doing these big ones. But you can also do the small ones if you don't want it like so elevated, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, I don't even know, what is this for? This just might be like design or something. But yeah. And of course there's grips on the bottom of the keyboard to keep it from sliding across the desk and all, which I think is of course super convenient and you know, most keyboards have this. And it also has these three little bulbs and I'm pretty sure these are lights for like num lock and um, was it caps lock? So yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what these buttons are for. I mean, there's generally buttons like these on most keyboards that, you know, show you what's going on. And one more thing in case you guys were wondering, um, I actually uh, forgot, but there are, well, I barely noticed it that I realized that I forgot to show you guys that I realized it. These are like actually like little compartments with things in them, which I thought was pretty cool. Like they have like the cords and stuff for the keyboard. Let's go ahead and open up this box. Little tiny box, like little mini box. And of course we have a super cute pink cord. And then in the smaller one, I'm really not sure what is in this one. Like literally what the heck is in this one? What is that, keycaps? That actually might be keycaps. They are keycaps. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna freaking cry. Keycaps. <gasps> and it is a, oh my gosh, wait, I can't even talk. <laughs> and there's a lavender keycap puller. <gasps> oh my gosh, like I've never seen such a cute one in my entire existence. Okay, so this is held in by Velcro, and then you, of course, you just plug this into the computer. I mean, you plug this into the um, keyboard, and then this goes in the computer. Let's not get confused now, Ashley. Let's not get confused. All right, here's the little covers. We don't really need those. Let's like toss that to the side. Who cares? This is some really cute like cording. Like I really love pink cords. I have pink cords everywhere. Like if I can find a pink cable for something, I, I'll buy it. I'll get it. <laughs> Anyways, let's see. Let's see these keycaps, all right? Let's see what's, let's see what's popping with the keycaps. Oh, so these look like just like other little symbols of um hello kitty oh and we have one echo logo this looks like the monster high logo like actually low-key okay anyway so here is a cute little hello kitty one and then we have another hello kitty one like little dessert and then we have what is this a hello kitty apple cute then we have a hello kitty alarm clock hello kitty goldfish or like just a fish with a bow on it we have a hello kitty umbrella what is this, a Hello Kitty bag? Or like, oops, is this a toolbox or like a lunchbox, I'm guessing? And then we have a Hello Kitty, I don't even know what this is. And then, ooh, is this upside down? Girl, what is this? Girl, what is this? Oh man, I'm confused. And then we have a Hello Kitty airplane, finally, one I can comprehend. All right, so these are just extra keycaps. I'll probably actually put some of these on my, um, uh, what is it, Razer Huntsman V3. Yeah, maybe I'll do like a keycap replacing video because I've never used a keycap puller. I've never actually had a keycap puller in my hand. Let's see what this does. Oh, it literally just rips it out. I mean, of course, Ashley, duh. Now it's stuck, I'm an idiot. 
Wow. That's actually so cool. So on camera, you've now witnessed it. That was my first time ever pulling a, um, a keycap off with a keycap puller and not my dirty fingers. <laughs> Cause last time I was just like, <laughs> it's not a good look for me, okay? That's actually so cool that they had all this stuff in the box. This is actually so adorable. Again, one huge thank you to Aiko. A huge thank you to Aiko. All of Aiko's like contact information, all their social media will be linked down below, including the link for this item. So yeah, make sure to check it out. You know, if you want this keyboard too, check it out. Very adorable. Oh my gosh, guys, thumbnail moment, honestly. This is a huge thumbnail moment. Yes, I'm spamming screenshots. No, I'm not ashamed. Okay, so let's go ahead and do the typing test. Oh, guys, it's gonna look great, I promise. I'm gonna make this like typing test as cinematic as possible. I mean, I'm, I've already built up the suspense long enough. So uh, roll the clip. All right, guys, time for the typing test slash the ASMR test. Now let's just dust it off a bit. <laughs> and I'm just gonna like type out a bunch of random things. So here we go. Sorry if my hands look a little weird. I'm trying to like curve, like literally curve my hand around the like tripod, the makeshift tripod, by the way. Also, in case you wanted free ASMR. You know? Today we're gonna be doing What happened to the original plot of the movie? What happened to the original plot of the movie? That was literally like super satisfying, guys. Like, oh my gosh, I love the way this keyboard sounds. Um, I think my Razer one has like green tactile switches, like the clicky ones or something. I think it's green. I'm pretty sure it's green. But yeah, these are orange switches, which I've never had before, honestly. And pff, they're so good. Like, what the heck? Oh my gosh. I really like the, like, soft. It's, like, hushed but clicky. You know what I'm saying? It's, like, a perfect medium between, like, super clicky and super quiet. So this is what I'm really loving about the switches overall in this keyboard. And oh my gosh, guys, so cute. Okay, let me go ahead and do my outro because I've been talking way too long already. So yeah, guys, um, if you did enjoy this video, please make sure to hop on that like button, comment down below, and subscribe to become a bunny and to join the bunny garden. This has been your girl, Ashley Bunny here. Bye, moi.